I'm Nick Arnold, the president of Arnold Packaging. We're always looking for products to add to our product line that makes sense, and by that I mean they're in our lane. Um, a, a lot of our, our friendly competitors um, or even partners in the industry, meaning they're, they're likely in another geographic area, have ventured into janitorial, they ventured into office products um, as a way to try to sell more products to existing customers. We've looked at it uh, a, a few different times and it, it's just far enough out of our lane that that's probably not a direction that we will go. Now that said, we didn't have an automation division a year ago. So I looked at that and said, all right, here's an opportunity. Um, our customers are asking for help. There seems to be a shortage of supply. There's not enough engineering. Our customers don't have the, the capacity internally to design these solutions. So we got into automation uh, in about four days. You know, I, I looked at it and said, we need to do this. This is the future. And then we need to talk about how we're going to go to market. We realized quickly that it was going to be tough to sell a robotic arm under the name Arnold Packaging, especially if we were in, let's say, a machine shop that really didn't have a big packaging component. So it made sense to break out that automation division. Um, so yeah, organic for, for us means all of it, and we're considering um, all different pieces of organic growth. I see automation as the future uh, with, with unemployment now at 3.9% in Maryland and, and in the United States. Workforce is gonna be a big, big challenge, um, and skilled workforce is gonna be a big challenge. So I, I see us fitting in to help our customers to get more productive and looking at the relationship between output and input, which is what productivity is, um, and getting the humans doing the right job in the right place, and then deploying machines, whether it be you know, robotics arms or just a you know, simple automation. It could be case erecting, case sealing. Things aren't as quite as glitzy or glamorous as, as shiny robotic arms, but they're very effective where we can use the same amount of, of input being manpower and get more output. Um, but the real goal is to, is to get the, productive, the productivity uh, quotient leveled so that we have the right people doing the right thing. So automation is gonna be heavy for us. Um, continuing to partner more deeply with customers and, and understand what their challenges are. Our customers have never been more challenged uh, from a global perspective. Their competition is global. We have some barriers, as we talked about, with freight and some things, but they may not. So they're now looking at, at the competitive landscape, and they need to make sure that they're viable from a competitive perspective. And our job is to help them understand, what, is, is to understand what their challenges are and what keeps them up at night, and then to make sure that our solutions and our future offerings are, are going to mirror or be collaborative to what they're doing, too.